Gents, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into something that might sting a bit. Why Sigma males have no friends, the bitter truth. Now before you start shaking your head, hear me out. We all know the Sigma male isn't your typical guy. He's independent, mysterious, and moves through life on his own terms. But this comes at a cost. Sigma males often find themselves without many friends. Sounds a little harsh, right? Well, before you grab your tissues, let's talk about why this might not be as bad as it seems. And trust me, by the end of this video, you'll see how being a Sigma male, solo life and all might actually be the most powerful position to be in. So buckle up, grab a drink, and let's break this down. Number one, the lone wolf mentality. Let's start with the most obvious reason why Sigma males tend to have fewer friends, the lone wolf mentality. Now you've heard this before, the Sigma doesn't need a pack to survive. Unlike the alpha male who thrives in groups, Sigmas are perfectly content walking their path alone. This isn't a choice born out of loneliness, but out of necessity. They're fiercely independent, relying on their own strength and intuition to navigate the world. Think about it this way. You've seen those lone wolves in nature documentaries, right? They don't stick with the pack and they don't follow the crowd. They're out there, surviving on their own terms, adapting to their environment with a razor sharp focus. Sigma males do the same thing in society. They observe, adapt and thrive alone. The downside, this self-sufficiency can make them seem unapproachable or distant. People see them as lone wolves and assume they don't want friends. When in reality, they just don't feel the need to constantly surround themselves with people. This doesn't mean they don't value relationships. They just value meaningful ones over quantity. Quality over quantity, always. And here's a quick example. Picture that guy in your office or class who's always doing his own thing, never caught up in office gossip or pointless chatter. People admire him from a distance, but rarely approach him. Why? Because he gives off this vibe that he's got everything handled and doesn't need help or friends. Number two, they don't play by the social rules. Next up, Sigma males have zero interest in following the so-called social rules. You know, the unspoken expectations that most people follow just to fit in. Whether it's keeping up with trends, social hierarchies, or even small talk, Sigmas don't engage with these norms. And because of that, they can seem like outsiders. Here's a little story. Imagine you're at a party. Everyone's gathered around, talking about the latest TV show or some viral trend. Then there's the Sigma guy. He's in the corner, probably sipping on something, completely disinterested in the chatter. If you were to approach him, you wouldn't get surface level banter. He'd likely dive straight into a conversation about personal philosophy, the universe, or the future of artificial intelligence. And that's if he even chooses to engage at all. Now here's the kicker. Most people don't know how to handle that. They want the comfort of small talk, the ease of lighthearted conversation. The Sigma, he cuts straight through it. For him, it's about depth, not fluff. And that means he naturally ends up on the outskirts of social circles. He's not playing the game because frankly, he doesn't care about the game. He's focused on his own journey, and anyone who can't keep up isn't worth his time. But this outsider mentality can be both a blessing and a curse. While it keeps fake friendships at bay, it also means there are fewer opportunities to form connections with people who don't operate on the same wavelength. Number 3. The No Drama Zone We've all been there, drama seems to follow certain people like a bad smell. Whether it's gossip, misunderstandings, or full-blown conflicts, some thrive on drama. But not the Sigma male. In fact, if drama were a person, the Sigma would ghost them without a second thought. Sigmas value peace above everything. They're not interested in the constant back and forth of emotional roller coasters that many people experience in friendships. If a relationship starts to feel like it's taking too much energy, creating unnecessary stress, or pulling them into trivial disputes, they'll exit, stage left. Clean break. Here's an example. Imagine you've got a friend who's always caught up in drama, calling you late at night to vent about their latest argument or asking you to choose sides in a petty conflict. 
For most people, they'd stick around, try to be supportive, and get dragged into the chaos. But for Sigma, he's cutting that cord faster than you can say toxic. He knows that engaging in drama is a waste of his energy, energy that could be used to focus on personal growth or achieving his goals. This makes him a bit of an enigma. People see him as calm, cool, and collected, but also a little detached. They don't understand why he won't get involved in their day-to-day -day dramas, and that can push them away. But hey, that's just fine with the Sigma. Number 4. Their time is their most valuable asset. If you could boil down a Sigma male's philosophy into one mantra, it might be this. Time is the most precious thing I own. And because they know this, they guard it fiercely. Now let's be honest, gents, most of us waste time. Whether it's scrolling through social media, binge-watching shows, or just hanging out aimlessly, we don't treat time like the valuable asset it truly is. But the Sigma male? He does. Every minute is accounted for. Every hour is an opportunity for growth learning or building something meaningful. So when you think about why Sigma males have fewer friends, this is a big reason. They simply don't have time for the typical friend-related activities that others might. It's not that they don't enjoy a good conversation or hangout, but they'll prioritize their goals over socializing every single time. Imagine a friend calling up a Sigma male and saying, Hey man, let's grab a drink tonight. The Sigma will pause and think, Is this really the best use of my time? Nine times out of ten, the answer will be no. Not because they dislike their friend, but because they value their time more. And this mindset tends to drive people away. Not everyone will understand it. But for the Sigma, time is irreplaceable. They'll choose a solo night working on their next big idea over a casual hangout. And in the long run, this mindset is what often sets them apart as high achievers. Their focus is laser sharp, and their goals are constantly being moved forward, one block at a time. Number 5. Intimidation Factor This is where things get a little tricky. Sigma males often don't realize just how intimidating they can be. It's not about being aggressive or domineering like an alpha male. It's more subtle than that. It's the quiet confidence, the intense self-assuredness, and the lack of need for external validation that makes people feel uneasy around them. Think of it like this. Imagine walking into a room full of people, and there's one guy sitting by himself, perfectly content. He's not looking for attention, he's not trying to prove anything. And yet, there's something about him that draws your eyes. That's the Sigma. He doesn't demand attention, he commands it without even trying. But here's the problem. Most people are intimidated by what they don't understand. The Sigma's calm, cool, and collected nature can be mistaken for arrogance or indifference. People might think, why doesn't he want to join us? Does he think he's better than us? The reality is that the Sigma isn't even thinking about them. He's in his own world, and that world doesn't revolve around others' opinions. And that's intimidating. People like to be needed. They like to feel important. But the Sigma? He doesn't need anyone's approval, and that can make him seem unreachable, which only widens the gap between him and potential friends. Number 6. High Standards, Few Friends This point can't be overstated. Sigma males have incredibly high standards when it comes to relationships. Whether it's romantic or platonic, they don't let just anyone into their lives. And this isn't because they're picky for the sake of being picky. It's because they know their worth and they don't settle for less. Think about it this way. The Sigma male's social circle is like an exclusive VIP club. There's no open door policy here. You don't get in just because you exist. You get in because you offer something real, whether it's loyalty, depth, or mutual respect. Most people, they don't meet those standards. Here's a scenario. A Sigma male might meet someone new and engage in conversation. But within minutes, he's already evaluating whether this person brings value to his life. Is the conversation deep, interesting, and meaningful? Or is it shallow and superficial? If it's the latter, that person won't be getting a call back. This high standard means that Sigma males end up with very few friends, but the ones they do have, those friendships are unbreakable. 
A Sigma male would rather have two or three deeply meaningful relationships than 50 acquaintances who barely know him. It's not about the numbers, it's about the quality of connection. And that's why most people just don't make the cut. Number 7. Misunderstood and Misjudged Being misunderstood comes with the territory of being a Sigma male. Because they operate outside the traditional social norms, people often misjudge them as aloof, arrogant, or even rude. The truth is, Sigma males aren't trying to offend anyone. They're just not interested in fitting into the typical molds that society expects of them. A Sigma male might go to a social event and keep to himself, not because he's unfriendly, but because he doesn't feel the need to engage in small talk or social pleasantries. He's perfectly happy observing from the sidelines, absorbing the energy of the room, and thinking deeply about the conversations happening around him. But this behavior can easily be misinterpreted. People may think he's disinterested or too self-important to socialize. And let's be honest, gents, most people are quick to judge what they don't understand. This makes it harder for Sigma males to form new friendships, as they're often seen as too cool or too distant to approach. Yet, being misunderstood is something Sigmas embrace. It's part of their identity. They know that not everyone will get them, and they're fine with that. After all, being understood by everyone would mean you're just like everyone else. And a Sigma? He's anything but typical. Number 8. They see through fake friendships. Here's a trait that makes Sigma males incredibly powerful, but also incredibly isolated. They have an almost supernatural ability to see through fake people. It's like having built-in radar for BS. Sigma males can instantly tell when someone's being disingenuous or fake, and they'll cut ties before things even get off the ground. Imagine this. You're in a group of friends and everyone's laughing and getting along, but there's one person who's clearly putting on a show, acting like they're someone they're not to impress others. Most people might overlook it, give them the benefit of the doubt. But the Sigma? He sees it for what it is, and he's out. This makes the Sigma male incredibly selective about who he lets into his life. He's not going to waste time on people who are only around for the wrong reasons. Whether it's because they want something from him, are trying to use him, or are just trying to look good in front of others, the Sigma male won't stand for it. This ability to spot fake friendships early keeps the Sigma male circle small, but it also protects him from getting burned by toxic relationships. At the end of the day, the Sigma would rather have no friends than fake ones, and that's a rare strength in today's world. Number 9. Embracing Solitude While most people run from solitude, a Sigma male runs towards it. Solitude isn't something to be feared, it's a time for growth, reflection, and deep thought. Sigmas know that the time they spend alone is some of the most valuable time they'll ever have. Here's an analogy. Think of solitude as the gym for the mind. While others are out socializing and filling their time with distractions, the Sigma male is working on himself, mentally, emotionally, and sometimes even physically. He's reading, learning new skills, or simply reflecting on his life and goals. While others might see this as lonely, the Sigma sees it as freedom. He doesn't need to be constantly surrounded by people to feel fulfilled. In fact, solitude is where he thrives the most. And this is something most people just don't get. They're always looking for the next social event, the next hangout, the next distraction. But the Sigma? He's perfectly happy with his own company. The ability to embrace solitude is a sign of true strength. It's in these quiet moments that the Sigma male finds his power. He's not afraid of being alone because he knows that in solitude, he's free to be exactly who he is without the pressures of society weighing him down. Number 10. They're a rarity. Last but not least, we have to acknowledge that Sigma males are a rarity. The way they think, the way they move, the way they approach life, it's all unique. And because of that, they're often seen as outsiders. But being rare is a double-edged sword. On the one hand, it means that there are fewer people who truly understand them, fewer people who resonate with their way of thinking and living. On the other hand, it's this very rarity that makes Sigma males stand out. They're not like everyone else, and that's what gives them their power. 
But being rare also means that friendships are harder to come by. Most people simply won't get the Sigma male, and that's okay. The Sigma is perfectly content walking his own path, even if that means walking it alone. Having said this, gents, if you see yourself in this Sigma mindset, don't forget to like this video, hit that subscribe button, and join this community of lone wolves. It's time to embrace your inner Sigma, apply these qualities to your life, and become the most powerful version of yourself. You don't need a crowd to validate your worth. You've got everything you need within yourself to thrive. Until next time, stay sharp, stay strong, and stay Sigma.